tuko katika viwanja vya Nakuru Athletic Club hapa nchini Kenya na tunafanya program tunafuatilia program maalumu hii ya Kit for Africa ambayo huwa ni maalumu kwa ajili ya watoto wadogo na imekuwa ikiendeshwa na club ya Everton ya England na safari hii hapa nchini Kenya ni kipindi cha mashindano ya Sports Pesa Super Cup uh, moja wa wachezaji nyota au legends uh, wa Everton ya kubwa ya Ben huyu kutoka Nigeria yuko hapa kwa ajili ya shughuli hiyo kama unavyoona sasa hivi wanaendelea kutoa mafunzo kwa watoto uh, wadogo wa hapa mjini Nakuru inapofanyika michuano hii Kids for Africa ni program maalum ambayo uh, wadau wa Everton wamekuwa kichangishana kupata uh, vifaa ambavyo vinakuja kugawiwa kwa watoto wadogo. Uh, watoto hawa wanagawiwa kwa sababu watoto wa Kiafrika kawaida yao unajua kwamba wengine hawana viatu, wengine hawana ile uh, moyo wa kusema wanaweza wakashiriki katika michezo. Kwa hiyo Kids for Africa inafanyika makusudi kwa ajili ya kuwa rejeshea moyo watoto kuwakomboa kuambia wafanye nini kuambia eh, wanaweza kufanya kwa sababu hata Yakubu mwenyewe akiwa Nigeria wakati mdogo alicheza bila kutumia viatu sasa uh, ili kuwapa moyo waweze kuendelea kwa sababu vipaji vingi vya Afrika vinapotea kutokana na watu kukata tamaa kwa hiyo Kids for Africa kina, inachofanyika ni kuhakikisha watoto wanarudi katika ile hali ya kuamini kwamba kile walichokuona na kiwezekani basi kitawezekana kuwainua kutoka pale walipokuwa kuambia inawezekana ili waweze kufanya vizuri kama yeye sema ingawa tumezungumza na Yakubu baadaye utaona amesisitiza kwamba kufanya vizuri kufikia walipo au walipofika yeye ni kazi ngumu inahitaji kujituma inahitaji kufanya uh, mambo ya ziada kuhakikisha wanafanya vizuri tumezungumza na Yakubu katuambia mambo mengi sana moja wapo ni hilo lakini amesisitiza kwamba kuna anaamini na timu nyingine za England na kwingine Ulaya wanaweza wakafanya program zao kuisaidia Afrika kitu ambacho kinawezekana kabisa uh, maybe uh, can you tell people what's uh, kit for Africa it's good, you know, to be here today to represent the uh, Everton Football Club is, is, is good. You see these kids, you know, in the street, they have a dream to play football, but they don't have the encouragement to, to fulfill their dream. To be here today to present them some gift, some t-shirt and uh, boots, it's good to encourage these guys to be something in future. But it seems like you can encourage them today after you live here. Who can encourage them to continue doing what you think you'll be good? I think the coach is here as well, you know. The coach, I think he can still do better, you know. I'm just here to give my experience with the one I had already to make them become uh, better players. They have to listen to their coach and uh, it's hard work. It's not going to be easy, like I said, you know. They have to push, they have to listen, they have to, they have, to have the right mentality to, to succeed in football. And, and how does far uh, kids of Africa go? It's encouragement. You have to encourage these uh, young kids. You know, sometimes they may, they might be get carried away. You know, but you have to be patient with them sometimes. But you have to push them a little bit to, to tell them when they're wrong, they're wrong. When they're right, you have to you have to tell them to push them to fulfill their dreams. And now Everton is doing this, but uh, we don't see other teams from Europe coming doing this to Africa. Maybe, do you have any advice for them to do this? I think uh, Everton decide to do that. I think uh, other teams in uh, Europe, they have their own style of doing their own stuff. So it's different. We, we are here today to show what we're doing. Maybe some of them, they don't show it. It's different. In Africa, like Kenya, Tanzania, we have may, or more more talents. But we don't get these kind of things encouraging, as you say. Maybe instead of encouraging, what are we supposed to do for our talents, make them grow? You, you don't need to. You don't need to stop. You have to keep doing it. I think uh, everything they're doing a good job now. For the past uh, one or two years, they've been here already, and uh, hopefully other teams in Europe will follow the same and uh, get some players. I watched some of the players they trained yesterday. They're really good. They just need the people to, to push them a little bit and then have the luck, they'll be fine. I mean, maybe you said you played with those shoes and this is my last question, that what did you do to become Yakubu? Other it's, hard, it's hard work. You have to believe, you have to work, you have to have two, uh, ten times better than the one you're doing now, you know. You work so hard, you believe even when it's not going right, you, you keep believing. The day we come, as soon as you get it, you take your chances and at the end it's history. Thank you. We welcome you. Thank you very much. All right. Thank you.
Everton amekuwa wa kwanza kupitia wadhamini wao Sport Pesa ambayo inatoka Afrika na huenda ikawa imechangia kwa wao kurudi huku Afrika kuja kurudisha kila ambacho wanaona kiweza kawa ni msaada na inawezekana hata timu zao dhaminiwa na makampuni mengine pia zinaweza zikafanya namna hiyo. Sisi uh, Global TV online tuendelea kuwa hapa uh, mjini Nakuru tukiendelea kufuatilia mambo mbali mbali ikiwepo finali hiyo ya uh, Sport Pesa Super Cup ambayo itapigwa mjini hapa kati ya mabingwa wa Tanzania Simba dhidi ya mabingwa wa hapa Kenya Go Mahia ambao wanapewa nafasi kubwa kutokana na timu yao kuwa pamoja kwa muda mrefu na inaonekana inacheza kitimu zaidi lakini Simba wamesisitiza wao wanaamini kabisa finali huwa ndio mambo yao na watachukua hili kombe sisi kazi yetu ni kusubiri na kuona kitakachokuwa Kids for Africa Super, Sport, uh, Super Cup ya Sport Pesa ambayo inakamilika kesho ndio ambacho kitakuwa tunakuletea kuhusiana nini kimefanyika, nini kimetokea na kadhalika. Global TV online tunaendelea kubaki hapa na kuru nikiwa mimi uh, Sale Ali Jembe na wenzangu wawili Hila Daudi pamoja na Musa Shigera Mateja. Uhondo wa michezo tulokuwa hidi tayari umeshaingia mtaani na wengi umeshaukubali. Wewe ukingoja nini? Ni uhondo wa Sporty Extra gazeti bora la michezo Tanzania linalokata kiu yako kila Jumapili ambalo limesheheni takwimu za ligi kuu ya kandanda Tanzania bara, Premier League ya England, La Liga ya Hispania, Serie A ya kule nchini Italia, Bundesliga ya Ujerumani na takwimu kibao za wachezaji. Ndani ya Sporty Extra kuna kijarida cha kabisa cha cross chenye makala bomba za kimataifa zilizo dadavuliwa na kunyambuliwa kwa kina ili kukupa uhondo wa Jumapili kwa shilingi 500 tu la Jumapili Sporty Extra hondo tu